everyone so this review is for make her wish come true by al brooks if you want to check out my review i have just posted that so if you're on youtube there's a link in the description below and if you're on my blog then there is a link within the post and this is the video review so make her wish come true by al brooks um this is just the cutest cutest story um it's got a slight christmasy holiday feel to it as well so it's perfect for this time of year and um it's just a really really lovely story but abby um who is uh she's dreaming of being a reporter it's one thing she really really wants and she gets this deal that she cannot refuse so um her friend is writing a story and all she has to do is fake date a woman um and then she'll get a co-writing credit for being a part of this this story that her friend is doing so erica is that perfect woman because um abby meets her when she and her daughter kayla are asked to come in for an interview following a letter that Kayla wrote to Santa about her Christmas wish. And they find themselves actually um, attracted to one another, which then complicates things a little, but um, they have to ask themselves, is taking a chance really worth it here? So um, this really was the cutest story ever. Kayla completely stole the show. I loved Kayla, she was perfect. And, um, and my heart, she was just so sweet and she was so cute and she really wanted her Christmas wish to come true and Abby and Erica were the only ones that could make that come true if they uh, were brave and took a chance on their feelings. So um, she just, her life wasn't, Ka Kayla and Erica's life wasn't the greatest and what I loved was that positivity, they both had it that, that accepting that um, life was still good and Kayla very accepted that you know even though she only had one mum and her mum was really really working hard and they made sacrifices and they only had basics Kayla was such a happy kid um and that was a lovely sort of sentiment to build into the story um that she wanted something more and she hoped for it but she was still happy and Erica and Abby um they were kind of from different worlds yet they were perfectly perfectly suited and they got on really well, they had this great connection, and then Abby was so generous and kind on top of that, even if she was kind of hesitant about a real relationship, um, especially with someone who had a child, that wasn't really in her plan. Um, but I admired how she embraced it, she was really good with Kayla, and you can tell why, because Kayla really got under her skin too, and that was it. There was just no way she was getting away. There's always a way when there's a little kid in the story, you kind of get under your skin, and then that's it, you're kind of hooked. And uh, it's the same for Abby. So there was real magic in the air with this story. Um, it made every second of it enjoyable. It was just such a special relationship being formed between Abby and Erica. It had me smiling the whole way through. I just loved it. And even if things hadn't worked out, um, both of them were doing what they were doing to be kind and supportive of one another and therefore had a friendship and that was lovely but Kayla really was the winner in this story um she really really was it was just a great holiday based romance uh for for Christmas and I can't wait to read it again I fell completely in love with it and the characters the storyline everything and we all know I'm like I'm already a massive fan of A.L. Brooks but this was just such a lovely story and um, that I'm I'm sure you will all be really really excited to read as well so I'll pop a link in the description so you can grab a copy of Make Her Wish Come True by A.L. Brooks which I really really hope you will if you've read Make Her Wish Come True would love to know what you thought of it so please do share your thoughts if you haven't read it yet but you're planning to read it it's on your to be read list or you're now super intrigued and thinking yes I really want to read that then again please do um let us know because it's always great to find out what you're interested in reading and if you do read it I really hope you enjoy it Bye.